Problem number five. Remember, lines L and M are parallel. We want to identify what kind of angles we're working with as well as solve for x. And we see the 8x minus 77 is here. The 3x plus 38 is here. They're on opposite sides, so we can say they are alternate. And this, again, is going to be an alternate exterior. They're on the outside of the parallel lines. And what we know about alternate exterior is that they are equal. 8x minus 77 equals 3x plus 38. I'm going to move my letter to the left. And we get 5x minus 77 equals 38. And we can add 77 to both sides. And we get 5x equals 115. 8 and 7 15. Yep. And divide both sides by 5. So we're going to end up with x equals need my space here, but uh, I think 23. I'm going to check it real quick. Um, 115 divided by 5. Yes, 23. Uh, again, use Desmos if you don't have a calculator. I just cannot flip the screen on these videos to be able to do that. If we take a look at problem number 6, 11x minus 47 is here. 6x minus 2 is here. So if you notice, both of those angles are underneath the parallel line and to the left, and we call those corresponding. And what we know about corresponding angles is that they are equal. Again, solve this the way your algebra one teacher taught you. I'm going to move my letter to the left and get 5x minus 47 equals negative 2. Add 47 to both sides and get 5x equals 45 and divide both sides by 5 and we end up with x equals 9.